Really? Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. How? Because I tried it on in the bedroom. Uh. His hair is everywhere. <laughs> Rachel, take you, DJ, with guidance from God and in greatest joy to be my wedded husband. In front of our family and friends, I commit my love and affection to you and you only. Today and every day, I vow to choose to walk with you in joy, in celebration, in trials, and in grief. I promise my faithfulness to you that together we may grow in the likeness of Christ and abide in His Spirit so our home may be a reflection of Him. I vow to rejoice with you when God brings blessings and to mourn with you when life brings us to our knees. I vow to love and cherish you fiercely and tenderly with each day the Lord gifts us, loving what I know of you and trusting what I don't know yet. As my husband and best friend, I have promised to put you before all other pursuits and endeavors as we form our new covenant family. In the presence of God, I make this vow. May this union between us from glory and honor to our King, Jesus Christ. Through God's grace and goodness, I, DJ, take you, Rachel, to be my wife. Ring on my finger, tag on my toe. I vow to give only you my unhindered love until the day I die. Through thick and thin, I'll be by your side. I vow before you and God my full loyalty. I promise to put you first, and I now shift my mindset from we to we, not me. This is the moment. The dials are shifting and I am reordering my loyalty. I am now more loyal to you, my wife, than I am to my family or anyone else on earth. I'm giving myself up for you just as Jesus gave himself up for the church. As marriage brings out the most vulnerable and fragile parts of us, I pledge to be your best friend, to be your emotional refuge and your safe place. I promise to forgive and serve you as we face our weaknesses together. We are a team. Your problem is our problem. My problem is our problem. I vow to fervently stand against anything that threatens to destroy our covenant. I will protect you and provide for everyone. I commit to the continual pursuit of intimacy with you. Rachel Ann Seacat, just as you, despite my imperfections, love me, I vow to love you from now until the day I die, flaws and all. In the presence of God, I make this vow. May this union between us bring glory and honor to our King, Jesus Christ. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no man separate. I pronounce that you are husband and wife. DJ, you may kiss your eyes.
Sweet Arizona. Like red rocks in the sun Her eyes were stained glass Like blue under the glacier runs Nowhere we're going Still don't know where she came from La la la, la la la, la 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 Singing take me home tonight I need you in my arms to wake up and feel alive Sweet Arizona, yeah, I just can't get enough You have this immense desire to help people God has given you a spiritual gift of helps or service. And I can tell you that when Julie and I would think through what would be the ideal husband for our daughter, certainly towards the top of the list would be service to others. Hi, I'm Abby. I'm Rachel's sister. And as three as of three hours ago, I'm DJ's new sister-in-law. Yeah. Rachel's not only a great leader, but also a person who is there to comfort others and a shoulder to cry on. Rachel, I have loved having you as my built-in best friend for the past 22 years of my life, and it's my honor to pass you along to your new lifetime best friend. God, thank you for marriage. Thank you for relationships, God. Thank you for the relationship that you want to have with us. Thank you for pursuing us with a passion and an energy greater than two people madly in love. God, you are madly in love with us. God, I pray your hand a blessing over DJ and Rachel over their marriage, over their jobs, over their children, over their friendships, and the people that you put into our lives, God. Amen. To DJ and Rachel. Rachel, I love you and welcome to the family. You guys, marriage is a beautiful gift. A gift. And I think this story shows God's mercy and his love for you guys. I have been waiting 28 years to have a brother. And I really can't think of a better man to take Rachel's hand and be with her and do life with her. I felt a lot of things today, a lot of emotions, a lot of gratitude. I just want to say thank you guys for being here from all over the world, from all over, for loving us so hard. I'm in love with this lady. I'm so excited to spend my life with you. Sweet Arizona. Now you're here next to me 24 7 days of sweet Singing take me home tonight I need you in my arms to wake up and feel alive Sweet Arizona, yeah, I just can't get enough I just can't get enough, no, I just can't get enough for you Sweet Arizona oh, 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 oh.
haciendo uno de veras. <risa>